Hi, John Marshall, the Drill Master. This is Norwich University's Shock Platoon at Mardi Gras Drill Meet, 2024, Tulane University. Oh. Uh, there's, uh, sorry, I'm... This was probably shot live. My computer was lagging a little earlier today, <coughs> which you can see here. Uh, but when the video does that, it's because it was shot live and there was uh, a pause in the transmission, uh, broadcasting it to uh, either YouTube or, or wherever it was. So uh, sorry about that. Um, that can give a, a, a strange effect. That's for sure. So why call uh, Cadence, uh, Commander? Unless, like the Fish Drill Team, it's part of the uh, performance. Boy, I, I wish the video was better. I apologize for that, but um, that was a you know a, a typical strong, quite powerful entrance for the. Uh, for the drill team. And that's a classic position holding the rifle up uh, at a modified parade rest there. Really interesting A B drill going on at uh, at different times. A B drill for those who don't know is uh, when part of the team. It, let's we'll just say A B. Uh, half the team does one thing, half the team does another thing, um, and then they switch or uh, they'll go back and forth. Or you can have A B C, which is three sections of. Uh, of the formation doing something different or in a ripple sequence but it usually goes back in order to have it be a B it goes back and forth instead of just ripple but you can have an a B a B C ripple so most everybody is uh, using uh, same technique so feet arms hands timing is uh, is quite good spacing also so far quite good Well, I spoke too soon on uh, on my computer not lagging. Now spacing here uh, and alignment. 
not working well and that is because of the feet you can track that down uh, <clears throat> and I'm, I'm not going to uh, go back but it's it every inch of a step every foot placement matters I'm supposed to step forward with my right and I step forward with my right over this way then I'm going to put myself out of alignment uh, at some point I like, uh, uh, I appreciate uh, the movement to get back into uh, a better alignment there. That was quite effective to move from uh, from those four essentially parallel lines into uh, a nice plus sign there. So what's the purpose of the commander being in the center? besides visual balance uh, you know the commander could be off to the side which since she has uh, uh, a sword or probably a saber uh, then her standing off outside of the uh, of the formation yeah saber uh, is is going to work at, well at least, at least it looks like it is going to work much better for the team here uh, you can see before the team got into this then uh, uh, into this position then that did work well for the team having the commander outside since the commander cannot integrate herself into the uh, the formation but but what was the purpose of the commander going into the center and then marching back out that doesn't make sense. A little bit of a timing issue there, uh, and then alignment as well, moving up. A unique way to uh, reform the uh, the block formation. But it 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 felt uh, it felt a bit parochial to take the the you know have them both march in a kind of a seed like formation the letter C little bit of a tempo change there but also uh, quite significant movement to regain alignment and spacing there in the uh, uh, the long line the the company front and it would have been better to have the commander completely out of the way instead of see the with the commander marching off slowly even this it, there's so let me I'll, I'll pause this right here so commanders moving off slowly and that means that eyes are on movement eyes are if you if you 
look at this performance, right now they're going. The, the team is going to go into a ripple line. And so you watch the ripple line because you look for movement. The eye always goes for movement. Plus you want to see what happens. So if there is movement in front of you and then something else, bam, right out of the corner of your eye moves, then you're, oh, what was that? Well, you just missed that. So while that's a, a good way to to create intrigue with your audience in that, oh, there's so much to watch here. I What do I watch now? What do I, holy cow, look at what they're doing. Oh, look at what, you know, something like that. That's that's good. This though, the commander marching across, in the commanders in front of the, the team, as they form the long line, the commander isn't out of the way. So the the, the audience is missing the full effect of the com, of the team forming the long line and beginning the sequence. As the team begins the sequence, the the ripple sequence back and forth, or however they're going to do it the commander is marching off slowly so now people are waiting for okay commander all right now now i can see the whole the whole ripple line so it's the the movement of the commander the commander is in front that's detracting from the the performance this part of the performance the commander is marching slowly off that's further detracting from the team's performance not exactly happening the way I think they uh, they're wanting some movements are going well you know it could be the videos lag or my computers lag that is uh, making it look as though the the ripple line is not happening as smoothly uh, as it could be. Obviously, when we see the little stupid circle there, that's that's just frustrating, quite maddening. So, Commander, you sidestepping over to get centered really doesn't communicate exactness. It communicates, oh, crud, I turned too early and I should be over here, so I need to center myself. started off with precision and ending up with less than precise uh, uh, movement here. So, Commander, why did you march back to the center of the long line only to stand with your back to your audience, still standing there, still standing there, had a, had a hit back there and... Uh, uh, but good recovery and yet all that time you could have uh, you could have been standing over at the side moved up in time to hit this would have been much better much more effective than just standing there waiting and waiting waiting and waiting okay now I'm going to go to present
So I'll just pause it right there. And uh, not exactly the uh, uh, the Shock Platoon performance that I expected. It it just didn't have that that energy that has been there in years past. It was uh, uh, going through the motions uh, at at uh, some point. Just didn't uh, didn't have that oomph that was that's been there before uh, years before. So uh, that's a that's a shame uh, because the the shock platoon has done some really good performances before. Well, um, so I apologize again for the uh, the lag at the YouTube. Or, or you know the individual who uploaded it uh, had a bit of lag. Probably was going live on uh, on the YouTube channel, and then also uh, the lag here. You know, internet problems everywhere, and I apologize for that. Didn't really come off with a uh, the best showing of a of a performance, but I could. You can just get that feeling that uh, it, it it's just not not there. The team has put in some practice. That's definite, uh, but that that drive really isn't there. It's not not communicating. Uh, anyway, so thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it.